I'm Paul DeGarabedian, Senior Media Analyst for Comscore with my exclusive box office overview for the week of July 8, 2022. Of course, Marvel topped the box office this past weekend with Thor Love and Thunder earning $144.1 million domestically and over $300 million worldwide this past weekend. In the number two spot, Minions The Rise of Gru, $46.1 million, a mere 57% drop. This film has been a social media phenomenon and has now earned $210.6 million and counting. In the third spot, Top Gun Maverick, $15.5 million in week seven. The film is now up to over $600 million domestically and becomes now Paramount's highest grossing film of all time, besting Titanic domestically at the box office. Now in the number four spot, Elvis, in its third weekend, continues to draw audiences $11.2 million this weekend and the film is closing in on $100 million in domestic receipts. And rounding out that top five is Jurassic World Dominion, which brought in $8.5 million this weekend. Jurassic World Dominion is up to $350 million domestically. And this weekend, we have Thor Love and Thunder, which I think in its second weekend will top the box office. Minions is going to be right up there in that top two. And then we have Where the Crawdads Sing, which is getting a lot of attention. Taylor Swift released some music from that film last week that got a lot of attention. So look out for that film. And also for kids, Pause of Fury, The Legend of Hank, an animated family film. And let's not forget the opening weekend for Mrs. Harris Goes to Paris from Focus Features that I think is going to do very well. It's getting great reviews so far. So I'm Paul DeGarabedian, Senior Media Analyst for Comscore, and I'll see you at the movies.